all right hey y'all how y'all doing happy friday i hope you're having a wonderful and blessed day evening night whatever wherever you are watching this vlog if you are new here my name is d if you like the vlog from when however long you've been watching it definitely just hit that like button um if you're not subscribed make sure you do subscribe i would greatly appreciate it both of those help me out with the algorithm and that's just your way of supporting me and the channel so i am currently at my daughter's school she has a dermatologist appointment um this appointment is just for her to um have the facial where they do the um is it microdermabrasion is that what I call it? or they just um take a like a little vacuum and you know take all the stuff out your pores so that's what she's going to do today and then I'm going to bring her back to school and then pick them up pick them both up later on so um her appointment is at 9 30 it's 8 30 right now um what else the boys are still sick um they just can't get rid of this damn cough i don't i don't know but my um co-worker told me a medicine to get um for them and anybody else in the house that has a bad cough um to give them that and that should help um, so I'm thinking about getting that. I'm also thinking about going to the beauty supply store because I want a new headband wig and Joblogs has been inspiring me to get new headband wigs. Um, she promoted one. It's on some hair website that starts with an A. I don't remember. Um, but that one looked pretty. And then she had another one that she got from one of her daughters they ended up getting that from amazon so i looked it up and i'm just like okay i'll go ahead and decide which one that i want to get um but at the same time i'm like do i really want to wait two days or two weeks to get hair online when i could just go to the beauty supply store and have it that day so a lot of kids being dropped off late what the hell but um yeah so that's pretty much what I'm trying to plan on doing um the boys are still at home with their father and um I made sure that I did not wake them up um, I also got the funds for Shay hair appointment tomorrow so got straight cash baby never been to this salon before I really don't have a, a salon home so hopefully this person who does her hair tomorrow does a good job and we could probably continue to keep going there um, but let me go ahead and go got all these daggone people like what is going on I don't understand got all these people all this traffic and they getting on my nerves so let me go ahead and get her I'm not going to take a clip of her doing her dermatology appointment um she's been there this is her third time so let me go ahead and go so I can get this girl out of school and then I will be back at the beauty supply store see y'all later hey y'all so as you can see I'm back at the house I did not stop at the beauty supply store like I wanted to um just didn't have enough time to do that so I may do that tomorrow or Sunday but I'm gonna take this out and then um, I'm gonna put on my headband wig that I already have I just gotta wash her let her air dry and she's good to go okay but I did go to Sally's and I went and got me some new shampoo and conditioner this is the Proclaim Professional Care Jamaican Black Castor Oil and Shea. It is a hydrating and reparative um, shampoo and conditioner. So I got that. Proclaim is a pretty good brand. I like them. Um, and then I got this Curl Essence Moisturizing Healthy Edges with Jamaican Black Castor Oil and Coconut Oil. That's how thick she looks. 
Okay. And then I got me another hard brush because my daughters keep taking my stuff. So I got another one of this. And what I plan on doing is cleaning these little bit of dishes that were left in the sink. And then I need to clean my makeup brushes and I also need to clean hair brushes, combs, all that stuff. So it is now 11 o'clock. I'm gonna give the boys a snack. And then um, while they're eating snack, I'm gonna be washing dishes, washing uh, makeup brushes and um, hair comb brushes and then also um, washing my um, headband wig. The only thing that I do is I just um, put it in cool water or cold water and mix conditioner in the water and then just let it sit for a little bit and then um, detangle it with a comb, let it air dry, good to go. Nothing too fancy because it's a synthetic headband wig and I'm actually interested in getting a um, what is, what is what is it called human hair um, headband wig so let me go ahead and get started feed these boys and I will be back probably tomorrow tomorrow.
everybody. Welcome if you are new. Welcome back if you're a part of the crew. I hope you're having a wonderful and blessed day, evening, night, whenever, wherever you're watching the vlog. Today is Tuesday. Today is my baby girl's birthday. She is turning the big one seven. Yes. Um, if you are not following me on Instagram, what are you doing? Go ahead and follow me on Instagram because all the pictures are over there. Um, so we didn't we don't really do much when it comes down to birthdays. We do, you know, a little celebration at home. And then, you know, since she's 17, she wants to go hang out with her friends. We'll probably do that this weekend. Um, but yeah, she got a couple of things that she wanted from she and got her that. And then um I got her some extra stuff from Amazon. I got her some chopsticks and she loves, oh, I can never remember this anime show, um, but she loves the char character. Is the show called Bakuban? Is that the character's name? I don't know. I forgot, child. So she got that. She's happy. Um, she got her cake that she wanted from Publix, which was delicious. Um, did a lot of running back and forth because I forgot to bring the boys um, car rider circle ID badge thing that we have to put in our visor or our window so that we, the lady can put their code information in and then they send them outside. So I had to go back to the house after getting her balloons um, and cards from Dollar 25 store. <laughs> so yeah, um, your girl was running around. Um, I still don't have my car no one still has called me and they closed their shop in an hour so i'm just going ahead and call um hertz and let them know hey can you please extend my vehicle for another damn day so officially my car has been in the shop for a week so hopefully i can get my vehicle tomorrow <laughs> Fingers crossed. Um, what else? Anything else going on? Oh, I took off from work. Well, I took off from work today. They approved it. So your girl's off. Don't need to go hustling, bustling, answering phone calls when I don't need to be doing that right now. So today is just going to be a real chill day. Like I said, we really don't be doing all that celebration stuff, parties, especially since COVID. That definitely solidified in-home parties with just the immediate family you know what I'm saying um especially with us having to battle with COVID at one time I'm just like no <laughs> I don't want to I don't want to be around people no more mm -mm, ew it's gross but um yeah that's pretty much all that we are doing today um it's just chilling around the house um I'm gonna catch up on I'm gonna catch up on some shows that I missed. And yeah. That's it. That's all. It is what it is. So um it's, this vlog is not gonna be long, I don't think. Um shouldn't be long because really didn't do anything. And of course I forgot to turn my alarm off for work, so it automatically cut off the camera. But once again, thank you so much for watching the vlog for Shay's birthday. Um, she really did enjoy it and she had a good time. She loves her clothes. She loves to watch um, and her cake. And she just loves, loves, loves everything. So I will definitely be back. I'm not sure when I'll be back the next time. Um, probably not until Tracy's dermatology appointment. Um, and then I think the kids go on spring break no they go on spring break in two weeks so hubby and I are still undecided about what we want to do as far as um if we're doing anything for spring break if we're not going anywhere for spring break then y'all I need to get new glasses if um we're not doing anything for spring break then we are just going to be local the biggest thing that we did was two years ago three years ago yeah 2019 three years ago we went to Disney and that was the last big thing that we did we went to Magic Kingdom for a day 
and then stayed in Orlando for two nights and three days and came back home. So that was like the biggest thing that we did, everyone as a family. So I really wanna do something, if not during spring break, at least um, over the weekend, sometime in March, maybe April, I don't know. But I definitely wanna do something with them because they've been doing so good this year in school. Even with them, you know, getting sick, they still manage to keep their grades up, mainly the, the girls. Y'all know, first graders, they only get satisfactory, excellent, and needs more work or whatever. Um, but yeah, so the girls have been amazing, keeping A, B on roll, if not straight A on roll um, throughout the entire school year. And, you know, when we had that hiccup getting COVID, they still bounced back made sure that all their um, assignments were completed and turned in, all tests were taken and completed and passed, and so on and so forth. So I definitely want to do something to celebrate that. And then with me and Dee working, you know, we gotta take time out for ourselves as well. So um, our anniversary, wedding anniversary is gonna be in July. So I don't know if we're gonna do anything for our five year wedding anniversary um but yeah we got that on the table as well so it's a lot um that i want to do especially with the kids so hopefully god willing um everything works out for us to where we can be able to do that and just have the kids enjoy themselves because they deserve it my husband and i we deserve it because we work we take care of the kids and we very randomly find time to just not have to think about work, not have to think about kids, just chill. You know what I mean? So I say all that, say this once again, thank you so much for watching the vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Once again, if you are new, thank you so much for watching, but make sure that you click that subscribe button, please. And also click that like bell or <laughs> like bell the like button so that way the algorithm can start pushing out my videos and getting to more people you know what i mean i'm trying to spread myself around to everybody not in that way okay we keeping it cute and we keeping it classy okay um also if you're subscribed make sure you tap that notification bell so that way when my video does drop make sure you click on that notification and watch the video when it comes up, okay? I would greatly appreciate it. So once again, thank you so much and we will see you guys on the next video. Bye. You guys like this video. Come on, give me up to 200. Like, 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 oh, like, 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 like.